ink. Um, like anybody got tats? Yeah, no. but I can't show you right now. <laughs> Gross. Oh. No, not that. <laughs> All right. Well, a little this, bit. The game that we're about to play is brought to you by the makers of playing cards. No, seriously, the the most famous playing the cards. Bicycle the bicycle playing, playing, playing cards? cards. Yes, bicycle. Bicycle has made a game about tattoos. Right, because clearly bicycle wasn't making enough money. I mean, on royalties alone, every packet they of... could have skirted their entire life as millionaires. I mean, but that wasn't was good enough. No, 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 they were not going to stop. No, there. they needed a piece of that hot, hot ink pie. It's, it's honestly because Gambit keeps taking all the cards and making them explode, so they're actually losing. Gambit, no, he just keeps buying him. It's dumb. It's, it's capitalism. There's no way Gambit <laughs> buys the cards. <laughs> <laughs> the floor is yours. <laughs> well, that's interesting. So you're saying he steals all those cards? Yeah, very much so. <laughs> anyway, anyways, <laughs> says, says the guy with me. You keep making the shine go on it, so I'm gonna keep reading. <laughs> it's so shiny. <laughs> <laughs> It's great. It's a lovely design. It is. Yeah. As you expect from the people from Bicycle. Um. So speaking of design, this is actually a design game. Uh, the oh. the elements of this game are very simple. Somebody is going to be the client. Okay. Would anyone here like to be a client? I'll be the client. Excellent. I can't draw. <laughs> I also can't draw. <laughs> <laughs> so be fun. Even better. <laughs> the way this is going to work is I'm going to need somebody who can uh, use like a cell phone or something as a timer. Vander, I happen to know your cell phone is right now. Of course, your cell phone was even faster on you. I just knew his phone was on the ground. Um, ultimately, we're going to get three minutes. Client. You're going to be drawing 10 of these cards. And on each card, I'll do some at random just so you guys get a sense of it. On each card, there are one or two words like paintbrush, my spirit animal, pin up, transportation. On each of these cards is an inspiration. Mm. Ah. Of the 10 that you're going to come in with, dear client, you're going to pick five for us. And once you've picked those five, we'll begin a three minute time. We, the artists, can ask you questions about your inspirations. Okay. The five inspirations. Okay. And during those three minutes, we have to incorporate all five inspirations into a single tattoo design on this here piece of board. Now, you can't say the word, though, is, or can he? Like, if you pulled out one, I think it said paintbrush, where he can't. Oh, he very much, he can show us. He's showing us okay. these. I didn't know if it was like a Pictionary thing. I'm a mime he's, looking he's, for a tattoo. Okay. He's looking for a tattoo. He's going to pick the five that he mm. wants. He's going to answer questions about them. So, for example, one of them said, my spirit animal. Yeah. So we have to ask you what your spirit animal is in order to oh, I got, I got you, I accurately yeah. depict okay. it yeah. right. on your tattoo design. At the end of the three minutes, we're going to pitch you because we're artists, it's our job. We're going to pitch you because we're going to vie for your coveted tattoo space. So at the end of this, you get to hire one of Right on your butt. That's right. That's right. We're going to assume it's going on your butt. So are we doing, okay. are we doing all five or of the five, we pick one? Oh, no, You're no. You're combining them. you got to have it all to keep the client oh, combines, happy. Combines. Okay. Here's another all thing. Right. Forgot to mention artists. Our tools of choice, while they do technically have an eraser on it, we're not allowed to use them. Oh. <clears throat> no right. going back. Because I'm in a real hurry. <laughs> Apparently, I, mean, I need this a tattoo is like, right we're now. We're functionally tattooing like <laughs> the pig skin. Right, right. This is, this is where we're at. Oh. So I'm going to take a stack of these so you can grab that 10. Point. Okay. Man, They're dry erase markers, so not actually tattoos. And we are going against Mink the Seder, the one who designs all of those crazy, beautiful uh, <laughs> uh, graphics and Pokemon uh, pens. You know, I just don't know if we can go against Mink the Seder, everybody. Um, anyways. <laughs> I adore you and your shameless plug. I take drawing commissions. <laughs> Watch me on Twitch. CosplayLaundry.com. <laughs> wow, you're worse than me. All right. I am bad. You started it. I know. Um, but I, I can guarantee somebody, it's not about how well you draw. It's how well you sell it. In fact, that even says it on the box. Oh, I'm sure they say it. It says, quote, 
good ink or bad ink, the art is how you sell wow, it. A, a thing that sells games is saying it depends on how you sell <laughs> I it. I know! <laughs> what delightful hacks! I bought this game unseen. A friend of mine was at PAX Unplugged, took a photo of this next to the business card of the bicycle company, mm. posted it online, and I mm. was like, mm. okay, can you pick up another copy? Oh, so since you are the uh, person in the right. client, you can also be timer as well. Okay. Oh my gosh, did, draw, did you draw your ten at random and now you're picking your five? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. thank God. I thought you were like taking that giant stack and like narrowing <laughs> it down to ten. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> what are you <laughs> doing? No, 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 no. We got one of those clients, am I right, artists? <laughs> oh boy. I like to believe we're in this like weird bullpen of artists, like yeah. talking smack I've been about the so clients. Many times to your shops, like this. My sword. Although I've been I've been asked to call this game tattoo. Tattoo. All right. All right. Dingling ling. <clears throat> oh, a client. Hello. How do you do, sir? <laughs> hello. 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 I would like one of those. Um, you know, acupuncture that stays. Um, ah, tattoo. Tattoo, yes. <laughs> I would like a tattoo. Smell like booze. I would like a tattoo that smells like booze. <laughs> and <laughs> yes, yes, that's right. A tattoo that smells like booze for, for my sure. bottom. Alcohol plus ink in the person's body is probably worse off. No, it'll blood. dilute. It'll dilute. <laughs> right, right. So, and I'm, I have a plane to catch, so I'm in a bit of a hurry. So okay, very good, very good. this along. So, um... I'm not exactly sure what I want, but I have a few things that I like. Kind of my personalities. You are. I like dinosaurs. You know, <laughs> dinosaurs. Yeah. Um. I like. I like. I like jet planes. They're so fast. Dinosaurs and jet planes. Oh, is everyone, it a movie like yes, that? Yes. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah. No, it's the snakes. The snakes. No, yeah. dinosaurs. Not snakes. Reptiles. Dinosaurs. Kind of like snake with They're legs. They're related. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Yes. My. Um. My, my mother, God rest her soul, lives in Pittsburgh, so I told her I'd, I'd get that in there somewhere. Pit, Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh? Right? Yes? Okay. Um, no, rip and, me. And, yes. Well, uh, but, but I want it to be classy. You know, I, I, don't want, I don't want something cheap and tawdry in my bum bum. Oh, so, no. um, I, I really, I, I, the classiest thing I can think of is the Mona Lisa. Oh my Lisa? God. Yes. Um, Cake's but, board goes like this. But I also <laughs> want it to be fun. I have a great sense of humor, and nothing is funnier than puns. So, oh God. so there we go. Um, so I'll just sit over here with a latte, and you can work on that. All right, um, and time starts. Yeah, Remember, if we don't get it yeah. in three minutes, it's free. <laughs> All right, uh, what about Pittsburgh really sells it for you? Smog? I've never been there. Um, so it's kind of the name. I really like the name Pittsburgh. It's like the worst possible name you can come up with a, for a city. It's like Holeville, Pittsburgh. Excellent, excellent. Yeah. yeah. Do you have a particular kind of dinosaur you like? Oh, do I have a particular kind of dinosaur? I like those dinosaurs with the horns. Beautiful. Yeah, the, 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 the just enough time for me to completely yeah, yeah, redesign the my big dinosaur. Horn thing. All right, time. <laughs> all right. Good lord, I ran out of time. Oh, Did you make it into art? Okay. All right, all right. <laughs> all right then, folks. Show who me what you, you got. Yeah, who would you like to uh, to see from first? Oh, okay. Well, let's find gentleman over here. Uh, sure. Um, yeah. Um, oh, dang. It's quite literal. Oh, I see, yes. That's a dinosaur in a jet plane over a smoggy city of Pittsburgh. Uh, that, is that my mom? Yeah, yeah right tell, us, tell, us, tell, us, tell us about your artwork. Uh, you got to right. sell it. Oh, well, right, so, sorry. <laughs> well, you, you told us you liked the um, the Triceratops you know, dinosaur. The no, I meant one. the other ones with horns. The other ones with horns? That's fine. Oh, uh, shoot! Right. No! And, we all um, fail. <laughs> oh, damn it. Anyways, and then, um, well, we all know Triceratops are great. Not not the greatest I'd actually find Jets, so he's a little scared on it. And um, he was going to get you the Mona Lisa, but he like his horns went through it. So he's kind of... Um, <laughs> oh, oh, I see. He's wearing the Mona Lisa on his head. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. And anyways, yeah, Pittsburgh, you know, factory, industrial city. It's kind of smoggy. And, um, like... The pun is the whole thing's a pun about 
um, life. It's a metaphor. That's so profound. That's so profound, Mister Yeet. Well, what have you got for me, young lady? Well, I've got uh, I've got the Mona Lizard. The Mona Lizard. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Very funny. Uh, so we've got we've, we you, she, her eyes follow you no matter where. No matter where. No matter where I point my bum. You're not quite sure if she's smiling at you. <laughs> that is the uh, Mona Lisa. Of course, you you did say that you wanted a word pun, so I made sure oh, I incorporated yes, the words yes. into the lovely that? banner. Um, I have I have a, a my take of a, a modern uh, UFO inspired uh, jet plane because Ooh. knowing how much you like the Mona Lisa, did you know there's actually some dude pointing up in the Mona Lisa to a UFO? <gasps> I know right. that's I an ancient aliens know. fact. Aliens. Oh. Wow, did uh, somebody tell Dan Brown? Oh, uh, probably. You know that bitty is all over that. So so I made sure that, much like in the original Mona Lisa painting, of which you were so inspired, um, we've got some thing off, off screen, as it were, in your case, off rump. Uh, right. so shooting. Okay, I mean, if you want, this could be like, this could be your butt. Oh. Right and it's shooting into the black hole. Oh. <laughs> So incidentally, this is going to be that that cheek. This is oh, be right, right. Anyway, right, yeah. anyhow, and I've, um, I've already got a map there. So and you did <laughs> say that the only thing you really cared about about Pittsburgh was was the words and um, true and yeah. and that your your mom was from there. So I just said no. I welcome. left her there. Oh yeah. well, welcome, welcome Pittsburgh. Oh, that's nice. Ain't that swell? <laughs> and much like the 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 real <laughs> Mona Lisa, it's it's unclear whether she's saying it or it's. Just words on a sign in the background. Unclear. Unclear. How artistic can you get? Listen, it's it's all about uncertainty. This this piece is in fact called uncertainty. <laughs> wow. Also for sale on Mink's website. I really like the Mona li Lizard. Title. What did you get for me, sir? Well, I was thinking of trying to find a place where tricer well dinosaurs in general Show and airplanes can all be at one. And you know, <laughs> what is Cybertron besides the Pittsburgh of planets? So, okay, Cybertron. Sure. So in the background, we have the war of Cybertron going on in, you know, the Pittsburgh of planets. Pittsburgh uh, of planets, of course. <laughs> I lost an uncle in that war. Oh, it was terrible. I lost my car. <laughs> uh, yeah. Unrelated individual. <laughs> Unrelated, he just lost his car. It's really yeah. sad. <laughs> Ah, uh, so, Cybertron, I mean, I was originally going to go with Megatron right, right there in front, but you specified the dinosaur, and since we all are just, had one dinosaur in mind when we thought about pointy dinosaurs. Apparently we know of one horned dinosaur. <laughs> that's it! Uh, and, yeah, that that is my wonderful artistic piece, and that's about as much explaining as I'm going to do. <laughs> oh, wow. Are you saying the work is going to speak for itself? It obviously does. Obviously. <laughs> well... I, I am sorry to say that I only have one rope, <laughs> and I can only choose one of these fantastic pictures. Um, hmm. Oh, well, you know, I think I'm going to have to go with the Mona Lizard, Woo! because that does include a pun, and that one's just too cerebral for my butt. It's I can't understand. <laughs> That would be great. Listen, up here. listen. I should... His head's up here. <laughs> My mistake was I saved the pun for last. Yeah. Uh, I think you started with. Oh man. Yeah. Uh, well, cause you know I gotta tell you when I saw dinosaur and then jet plane I was thinking dinosaur riding jet plane this has gotta be like this is the stuff dreams are made I, of. I went straight yeah. to a dinosaur jet plane and I was like I want to draw a transformer and then uh, and then, uh, and then, you, realized, and then you realized <laughs> crap I have three minutes to draw a transformer. And four other things. Oh, I mean, like, was, this was about as detailed as I'm going to go with any of my drawings. <laughs> Can I tell you my little, like, peanut butter white lie here? Couldn't remember it was Berg with an E or Berg with a U. So you just made a mess at the so end? So if you Amish zoom, yeah, I'm Amish zoom on that. Amish zoom on this, uh, you'll notice, can you tell what letter that is? Because I can't. Perfect. It's a verb. <laughs> it's a pits verb. It's a verb. <laughs> There's a G! There's an R! That works perfectly, because clearly the client didn't care. Exactly. <laughs> it's supposed to be a sign, but I learned early on, because I went to art school. Don't tell the audience what it's supposed to be. You tell them what's there. Yep. You make up a let, story let about why. That's right. 
Because you know what? They can tell you what it was supposed to be on their own time. But if you tell them, they'll be like, then why didn't you just give me that, you dink? <laughs> this is just All good right. life advice. Yeah. Never okay. tell someone what it was supposed to be. Always lie and say that this was 100% your best effort. That would be $1,200, by the way. Oh. Yeah. Well, I, I take, gotta get your plane. I take PayPal <laughs> and Venmo. <laughs> Where my art truly belongs. <laughs> this is a very clever game because... Because it's about lying. <laughs> yeah, I think it's... <laughs> well, it's more about cleverness because it's one of these cards, like the pun, I mean... Oh, that it. saved that me. When I saw Pittsburgh, I was like, oh, yeah. crap. <laughs> oh, pun I know me. nothing about I was... it. I've never been there. I don't know any landmarks. For all I know, there's I probably, know like, a tower. Just, like, no offense to exactly. anyone in Pittsburgh. See, I just know factories. Yeah, right in the comments, if you're from Pittsburgh, yeah. tell us something about if Pittsburgh. If was pun, I would have been like, yeah. yes, Mona Lisa style the Megatron penguins. blowing yeah. up Pittsburgh. I would have been fine with that. Yeah. Oh, man, that was such a good left field. <laughs> yeah, the pun? Town. Jeez. No, the town! The town? Really? Yeah, the yeah. city name. Like, ah, uh, for me it was pun. I, no, I was, I was just. You could have gone Paris, and we would have been like, uh, yeah, Twiffel. No, my first thought was London or something. I said, uh, you know, I was just talking to my sister-in-law about Punch. Pittsburgh. I don't and know, and then you just. It looked really, really nice. You just wanted to see a sweat. Yeah.